Hey everybody, welcome, Denis Me You here, Masterclass, and today we're going to talk about something crucial to your success. We're going to talk about goals. We're going to give you seven steps to reach your goal faster. Before we do that, we need to talk about what's slowing you down. Maybe you feel stuck, maybe you're unmotivated, maybe you suffer from procrastination, meaning you might be lazy a little bit, maybe you have no vision, no desire, you lost your ambition along the way. One of the major factors that's going to slow you down or prevent you to reach your goal is that you're not clear. Too many destinations brings confusion. Some of you have so many goals that you have all your energy, your money, and everything all over the place. Select one goal, one plan, and go for it. Clarity is power. So you need to know where you want to go, and you need to know who you want to become. You might know where you're going, but you don't know how to get there. No process, no direction, no idea how to get there. So good news, because right here we're going to give you seven steps to reach your goals faster. Click on the link below and you're going to get a PDF and you're going to be able to follow every single step with me. I recommend that you do one step per day. And at the end of the week, you will have the entire process and you're going to have a better chance to reach your goals than the people who don't have that PDF. So step number one, make the decision. That's huge, make the decision. Like this woman that you see right now, she can go left, she can go right, she can stay where she is, but she can even turn around and go the other direction. So make the decision. The first crucial step to get anything done is to make the decision to do it. That simple. If you're planning to do something minor, the choice is not as important, but you still need to decide to do something. And when you're thinking about something as important as your future, your mission, your vision, your dreams, your desires, this is huge. You will have to make several decisions along the way. At the beginning of any project, there's only one thing that matters. You decide to do it or not. Or you're going to do like other people, not yet maybe tomorrow. Don't do that. Take a piece of paper right now and you're going to go to step number two. Write it down. Write your goal down and write on the top right maybe non-negotiable. In my opinion, one of the reasons why most people are not reaching their goal is that because they don't take the time to write it down. If you take the time to take a notepad like this and write your goals, do you know that you're going to be more likely to reach your goals? 48% they say. The fact that writing your goals like this is going to make you think on purpose. And you're going to be 48% more likely to reach your goals. So do this right now. Write your goals down. Use the PDF below and write your goals down right now. Number three is now that you have a goals, now we need to clarify it. So you're going to look at your goals and you're going to ask yourself some question. What can I add? What can I modify? Think about it. Focus about it. Daydream about it. Research about it. Add more detail. Step number four, plan. You need to have a plan. You need to make a plan. Some people call it action plan, right? Plan. What's the best way to make a plan? I believe is to ask yourself the right question. And the first one is... What skills, what knowledge do I need to acquire in order for me to get what I want? Again, let me say that again. What skills, what knowledge do I need to get in order for me to reach my goal? The second one is how much time, how much money, how much energy am I willing to invest to reach a goal? And the third one would be, what's my big why? Why do I want to spend that much time, money, energy? Why do I want to learn that skill? Why do I want to get that knowledge? Why is it important to me? So before you go on, again, I will recommend that you take the PDF and you plan. You ask this question and you make a plan. And this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to go from there to there to there to there. It's going to take you a little while on this one. It's going to be more than 20 minutes. But this is one of the major steps of this action planning. Step number five is share. Share with that special person, maybe a mentor, maybe your spouse, maybe a coach. Share your plan with that person. Maybe that person could become your accountability partner as well. Do not share with the people who don't support you. Do not share with people who don't trust you. Do not share with the people who don't think you cannot achieve anything. Select one or two percent and share with them only until your goal is completed. The next steps is do the work. 
Look at your plan, you made some decision, you have some answer of your question, and now is the time to perform the red action. You might have to get out of your comfort zone, I get it, but that's the way we grow. You must do, learn, perform, create something every single day in order to reach your goals. This is what I believe. If that's a very important to you, take 15, 20, 30 minutes every single day, non-negotiable, and take action. Let me give you an example. There's five birds on a wire outside, five birds, and one of them decides to go to fly away. How many birds left on the wire? No, the answer is not four, it's five. The bird only decided to do it didn't do the work yet. It didn't take action. So don't be like everybody else. Take action every day. It doesn't have to be huge. It could be something small. But if you do something small every single day, momentum will pick up and you're going to get further and further and further. If you decide to go to the gym for seven hours on Monday, you won't be walking for the rest of the week. I think it would be better that you go 20 minutes per day. That's what I'm trying to recommend here. It's the same thing as when you're going to put a seed on the, on the ground, then you water your seed until it becomes a flower or whatever it is. But you need to water every day. That's the same thing here. You need to create a schedule. You need to create a habit. And you need to perform an action every single day. I really believe there's two things you need to do in order to reach any goals. The first one is you need to see it in your head every single day, as long as you can. Bob Poulter used to say, if you can hold it in your head, you can hold it in your hand. That is the number one thing you need to do. The second one is create an action every day. You do that day after day after day after day, I guarantee you, you're gonna reach your goal faster. Step number seven is review. Review your goals. You must take the time to review your performance or the lack of it. Could be every week, every two weeks, every month, every quarter, every, the end, every year. You need to examine your past activities and see if you are performing the right one. Reviewing your action and make the correct adjustments is crucial for you to reach your goals. So these are the seven steps to reach your goal faster. Step number one, make the decision. Step number two, write your goals down. Number three, clarify everything. Number four, create an action plan. Number five, share with the people who motivates you, supports you. Number five, do the work every single day. Number seven, review your results once in a while. Guys, my name is Denis Mayu. Don't forget to click on the link below. Download that PDF. Do one step per day in a week. You're going to be way ahead of most people. Good luck and uh, stay well and stay focused on what, on what you really, 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 really want. See ya.